So it's finished one all at home park. Does it feel like two drop two points dropped or one point gamed? Well, for us it was very important to have a strong reaction after a disappointing last performance and instead today I think that we can look at it in a very positive way because obviously we had very good periods during the game, we created chances enough to win the game and we were definitely, I think, quite dominant for, for some periods. Of course, we have a bad feeling because to concede at the end of the game in a set piece, in um, yeah, it's, 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 it's sad but that's the reality in football that when you got a lot of chances and you're on a score, uh, two or three goals to kill the game, then it becomes more difficult, of course. But um, I'm focused on the performance and I know that playing at the level we did today, uh, not as last day, uh, we have a lot of opportunities to win football games. It seemed like a quite a cagey game in the first half. What was said at half-time to make it such an open affair in that second 45? At this moment of the season, it's a lot about being relentless. It's about keeping the mental part of it, uh, being very focused. And I think that despite perhaps the first half was not as good as in the second, the reality is that we got a very clear chance with Ismidi uh, as well. So the most clear chances in the game were, were from us. That's definitely something that, that we can be proud of. But at the same time, we need to take our chances if we want to win the games. And how important was it that your players managed to pick themselves back up again after conceding to make sure we didn't leave tonight with nothing? I think the strong reaction uh, that the team showed today, it, it has been almost uh, like this every time we came from a, from a bad game, so to say. I think the game we played in the Stoke away was one example, then we reacted strongly. Um, the same it was now again, we had a bad game, everybody knew, and it was important to trust ourselves as well for all the supporters who came here to deliver something else that we did last game. And that was the case. Unfortunately, I'm a bit sad because, as I said, today getting three points was a massive, massive step forward. Well, at the end it has been one, we need to keep working and making sure that we get the three in the next weekend. And you mentioned the supporters before, travelling in their numbers again, that must fill you with pride even as the uh, manager of the players? I think they have been really, really good supporting us. I think that all the crowd as well was very engaged with us in the second half because when we give them good football moments, I think the QPR supporters understand good football and they appreciate that. It was a joy to play away and listening to them, uh, the, the, the way they supported. As I said, uh, I think that we need to deliver something else in the next four games to make sure that we finish this season in a strong way and this togetherness that we achieve, we need to, to keep in building together. So it's four points above the drop zone at the moment and in the worst case scenario it will stay four points above the drop zone after this round of fixtures. Is that something you look to as a manager or is it pure focus on the games and the performances themselves? My focus is always to look forward, to look up at the table, not down and I want to win football games. So I don't care how many points left, how many points will be behind or whatever it is. I just want to win the next games and we have opportunity now, four games. We're going to push to try to win all of them. And how do you get your players going again for another quick turnaround against Hull City in that next game on Saturday? Recovery, recovery now. Crazy fixtures. I think at this moment of the season everybody can feel it on the legs, but the guys are doing amazing. So it's about making sure that we recover well, quick and prepare the game because we're going to play against a team that has a lot of quality and is playing for big targets.